Hello, and thank you for joining us today. This video is brought to you by The Streaming Advisor, tailoring your entertainment through streaming. What we're going to talk about today is how to cast with a full screen from a laptop to a Chromecast. We have an article about it on the website today, but I'm going to show you how to do it in action. First off, head to the streamingadvisor.com. Click on the link for the article, or you can look it up with our search here. And there you are. I'm not going to read the article to you, but what we do is break everything down, tell you what you need, which is a Windows PC, Google Chrome browser, Google Cast extension for Google Chrome, and a Chromecast. And here's what you do. We provide links for everything. If you don't already have a copy of XBMC, you click on the link and go straight here. Because this is a Windows computer, you're going to download it right here from the xpmc.org website and get your Windows copy. Also, you'll need the Google Chrome browser. If you're not familiar with it, Google Chrome is the browser that Google put together. It competes with Explorer, Firefox, and others. Download Chrome by clicking on there. Accept and install. It takes care of it pretty much by itself. Once you have the Google Chrome browser, you need the Google Chromecast extension. Again, we provide a link straight to it. This is the one you want. Not the beta, not depreciated, but the regular browser extension. So, once you have everything set up, in order to get to the full screen mirroring option, you click on the section where your extension is, and you find this little arrow. You scroll down to cast entire screen. Next, you tell it where it's going. You'll notice a request screen. Do you want the Google Quest to screen with your audio? You say yes. If you like, you can hide this. If you like, you can hide this. If you like, that audio was coming from my television. Now, all you have to do is open up XBMC. And what will happen is XBMC is going to be right on your television screen. It's that simple. You just want to keep the volume on your laptop turned down because the video and audio is a couple of seconds off from what you see on your screen. Thank you for joining us. I hope that was helpful. It's certainly very easy. For more information, check us out at thestreamingadvisor.com by following the links in the description. Thank you and happy streaming.